Nuclear safety requires robust regulations. A country needs a regulatory system to ensure that activities such as generating nuclear energy or the use of ionizing radiation in medical facilities are safe so that people and the environment are adequately protected. Nuclear and radiation safety are national responsibilities. The IAEA helps countries to establish and strengthen their regulatory frameworks for nuclear safety through an expert peer review. It's called the Integrated Regulatory Review Service, or IRRS. Countries invite the review to ensure they meet IAEA safety standards. Before the IRRS mission starts, the host country analyzes its own strengths and weaknesses. This self-assessment exercise forces you to reflect on almost everything you do. The process was of great benefit for us. It was more benefit than we anticipated. The review takes about 10 days. IRRS team members interview national experts. They visit facilities such as reactors or hospitals to see how the regulatory system works in practice. And they pore over regulatory documents. We invite a group of senior experts from regulatory bodies all around the world. They come and gather in the host country and they look at the national, legal, governmental and regulatory framework for safety, nuclear and radiation, and they compare it against the IAEA safety standards, which are the benchmark for this type of review. After the mission, the team gives the host country a report with suggestions for improvement. The report also highlights areas of strength worth sharing with regulators worldwide. In this way, IRRS missions also help strengthen nuclear safety globally. But the process doesn't end there. The team is usually invited back later to see how the country has addressed its findings. Through acting on those findings and recommendations and making the improvements, there has been an overall improvement both to member state regulatory approaches and regulatory processes together with a combined overall improvement to global nuclear safety through the vast majority of member states requesting the service. In 2018, the agency marked a milestone with its 100th IRRS mission. It's now looking ahead as the service seeks to further strengthen nuclear safety worldwide. <laughs>